Hi, I'm Bob Birch, Web Technology Specialist with NDSU Agriculture Communication, and this is a short presentation on how to share images with participants in Microsoft Live Meeting, our web conferencing tool that we have available to us here uh, at NDSU. So if we were going to share this image that we see on the screen here, um, there's a couple of ways to do it. Notice that this is a, a pretty good quality image. It's got a lot of color and definition and detail to it and we want our participants in the live meeting to get that same quality the definition the detail the color uh, that is present in the original photo so one way that we can share that photo uh, on live meeting would be to do program or desktop sharing so if we open up live meeting here as a presenter we've got this content tab available to us if we go to the content tab and then click the share button you'll see there's a couple of options here one is to share a program and all the programs that you have open on your computer are open here and we could share uh, this Picasso photo viewer where that image is open and then the participants would be able to see that image another way to do it is instead of choosing which program to share you could share all of your desktop or a selected area of your desktop and again if that photo is open on your desktop uh, in the selected area uh, then the participants in the live meeting will be able to see uh, that image so that's the way that we have been doing this uh, as we've started out using live meeting uh, unfortunately when we do it that way um, one of the things that happens is the participants uh, do see the image but instead of seeing the high quality image that we saw before they see an image that looks like this and the reason that they that this uh, blurry sort of uh, low quality image comes up when you're using desktop or program sharing is that desktop and program sharing in live meeting is designed to only share a limited number of colors our original image has about 256 colors. When we share it on the desktop, uh, Live Meeting is only sharing a limited number of those colors. So you end up with a low quality image. Um, so desktop sharing or program sharing works great for text and for graphics that have a limited number of colors, 16 or 32 colors, you know, logos and and uh, clip art and things like that, that that have a limited number of colors. Desktop sharing and program sharing work great for that kind of uh, application. But when we're trying to show somebody a, a high quality photograph, desktop sharing, program sharing are not the way to go. Instead, what you can do is to go ahead and put your images into a PowerPoint presentation. And I'll explain why you might want to do that <laughs> uh, in just a second. Uh, this is going to help you share those images in live meeting. So I've got a PowerPoint open here and I'm just going to uh, browse for our image that we we're sharing. Here's our girl on a tractor and we'll insert that into a slideshow. And if I had more images, I could just put one on each slide and then go ahead and save uh, this PowerPoint presentation. We'll just call it test on the desktop and save that PowerPoint presentation. Okay. And now to actually get it into live meeting, I open up live meeting and I go to content, click the share button again, but instead of share a program or share your desktop, I'm going to choose upload file view only. And that'll allow me to find that file uh, on my desktop. Here's the PowerPoint presentation and go ahead and open it and load it up onto live meeting. Now you might ask, well, if you can do that, why not just upload the image file itself, the JPEG or PNG uh, to live meeting? And the reason is live meeting doesn't support those file types. It only supports file types that are created with Microsoft Office programs like PowerPoint. So now when I pop open my PowerPoint to share that with folks on my live meeting, you see I get all the colors, a full quality, high quality image that's being shared with my live meeting participants. So using that uh, PowerPoint tool and upload file in live meeting will help you share high quality images in Microsoft Live Meeting. If you have any questions or need any more help, you can always email me robert.birch, B-E-R-T-S-C-H, at ndsu.edu. Thanks.